Hello and welcome back to Everything Gaming uh, and today I'm going to show you a very very cool video to take advantage of all the AI driver tars uh, and basically win every single race that you create in Forza Horizon 4 um, on unbeatable difficulty so you can have all the assist turn off uh, make sure your driver tar difficulty is on unbeatable uh, and basically create a race where you can take advantage of the AI so we're going to get stuck in here and I'm going to show you how to do it very quickly uh, you're going to start off by creating a route now this can be any route in the game you want i'm just using the one uh elmsy on c or something at the bottom uh just as a guide because obviously it's on the motorway it's fairly quick um bearing in mind you can earn a lot of credits doing this method you can do it as a circuit or a sprint race uh, but in this instance i'm just going to do it as a sprint race all the way up the motorway to the very top here now in order to take advantage of the ai as you can see on the little mini map following you when you create a race is the blue line now that is basically the racing line that the ai cars will follow so anything you do they will do as well so as you can see here it may look like i'm going all spazzy on the road but there is a very good reason behind that and that is because the ai cars will follow this line and i will show you in a minute on a couple of well a couple of races that i've filmed but every single time i've done it it's worked the ai following that route and obviously it caused them to crash it caused them to mess up which is why you can do it on the hardest difficulty because obviously at the beginning there I took him around the roundabout whereas you can cut straight over so instantly you got a lead sort of doing things like this spurring off the road uh, which will slow them down while obviously you're caning down the motorway at 270 mile an hour you know it's things like this that will mess the AI up uh, they'll make mistakes and obviously you can just fly off ahead and like I said you can do this in a sprint race or a circuit race you can utilize it to make your own Goliath track where you guarantee your own wins so obviously you can basically use whichever car you want but it's a fantastic method to make the most out of the absolutely retarded AI. Like, it's absolutely hilarious the things you can do. You know, you can completely run them off the road, make them do circles around and around about a couple of times, whatever. Just as long as you don't place checkpoints there, for example. Um, so obviously place them in sort of usual places and mess them up around the other parts of the route. Um, so I'm just going to fast forward this bit here to get to the end of the route creator so obviously I can show you what I mean by the AI messing up. So obviously once you've created your route you obviously place a finish line if you're doing a sprint race or return to the start line if you're doing a circuit race. Now as you can see here I'm going to change it from expert that I was already on onto unbeatable. So I've got a plus 90% bonus credit right there. Now. I'm going to show you a couple of uh, clips where the AI mess up. So the first one here, I'm going to run ahead uh, and show you basically what I mean by them sort of veering off the route where you can take advantage by cutting straight across the roundabout. So there you can see they are following the blue line to a T. And I've just cut across the roundabout. I can then speed off and completely go all the way down the end of the motorway um, and win very, very easily. Like I said, these are on expert, uh, unbeatable difficulty, sorry. Um, and it's hard to see, as you saw there, why they're unbeatable if they're that stupid uh, now this clip I'm going to show you following the cars so like I said I can prove to you this is what they do they follow that blue line so as you can see it's all jagged and going off the road there but they are following it to a T on how I just did it um, like I said you can do this in whichever car you want if you've got a preferred car that's a Forza edition but it's not very quick utilize it you know make the most of it because there you saw they just all ran off the road and I'll show you here on the map you know when as you saw further on in the race I went to the other side of the road they're following it and they continue to do that so I didn't show many sort of create many mistakes in this race um, just so I could get it over with quicker but if you guys want to create one go for it because it's an absolute laugh and it's a guaranteed win every single time without fail um, you know do the most randomest loopiest stuff show me what you got I really want to see what you guys come up with because I think it's an absolute perfect way to take advantage of the AI um, and it's a very very easy way to guarantee wins on the hardest difficulty turn all the assists off you'll start making a ton more credits uh, and very comfortably obviously because the AI are nowhere to be seen basically so when you've obviously ran your race you'll save it as a blueprint I just saved mine as easy peasy if you follow me or if you add me as a friend you can find the routes you can test it out for yourself get a feel for it see what I mean when I say that the AI are stupid at times now obviously this won't work on custom made races by turn 10 because they've obviously made their own races following their own racing line which is sort of pretty spot on around corners etc um, whereas doing it <laughs> this way um, 
you can make the AI mess up as many times as you like. And like I said, do it as a circuit race uh, and you'll be guaranteed to win, you know, on the hardest difficulty. You'll be amazed by how much credits and influence points you can earn doing this. Um, so obviously at the end of the day from this race, it's a couple of minutes long, if that, because it's running the whole of the motorway. Um, very quick, very easy. And it's fairly decent rewards, to be honest. I can't really complain. Um, so if you really want to level up on the hardest difficulty, obviously you can set it to circuit, off-road, uh, or cross-country, level them up a bit, just by making the AI mess up. And obviously if you keep doing all these diversions, it makes the route length a lot longer, and the longer the route, the more credits you get for the race at the end of it. So if you do it as a circuit one, you won't even be doing half of the route, so it's sort of skimping out that way. But it's a very clever way to take advantage of the AI. Um, anyway, if this helped you out, if you're enjoyed it don't forget to drop a like and subscribe for more videos like this again a massive thank you for everyone's support it means the world to me um, and i will be doing a massive massive giveaway soon um, in forza horizon 4 but i hope you enjoyed and a massive thank you guys all the best